lot of people. There's a lot of people who are willing to like start up a crypto fund, promising like, like oh, we're going to be a bold experiment in, in UBI, and then it's it's just a pump for that. It becomes just a completely rational. The sun is up now. And it's time for me to eat breakfast. So, I made a smoothie with protein and avocado toast for breakfast. This is what I've been eating every day this week because that's how I roll. And I also put my lunch together to take with me. This is a busy, busy weekend. Um, <laughs> I've got events to attend. Uh, there is the Super Bowl, <laughs> which I may go to a party. I've been invited to a few. Um, that may happen. So we'll see. But first today, I've got to go work at the office. So I'm gonna eat this and get out of here. Y'all, I ordered this package months ago, but it's like, it brings me so much joy. I'm gonna show you. My towel for this. So during the last like open drop they had, I can't think of what you call it, but like, you can order as many as you want and as many colors as you want. And I ordered three. I don't know if I'm going to keep all three. I'll sell any that I don't want to keep. But the one I've been waiting on is this one. It is my new work tote. I already see the color. So, you can see that coming. Dust bag. Telfar to me is um kind of like low to mid luxury, but it is so useful. And this is a black owned brand. Uh, so, let me open them and I'll show you the colors. Look at my new towel, Feezy. It's black. This one is for work. Medium sized tote. Perfect. Your girl is happy with this. Then we have small, which I call these like mini bag versions. You know, they're not, they're not big at all. Look at this. This is the navy color. This is the one I wasn't sure if I'm going to keep. You see it against the black. Off camera. It's just as murky, like, it's not incredibly different, but it's a beautiful navy tone. And the last one is an ox blood. Look at this red. Yeah, this is beautiful. I just love the Telfar logo. I mean, what is there not to love about this logo? It's beautiful, beautiful bag. The leather is nice and soft. Yeah. So part of the reason, like, I don't think they're elevated enough to count as luxury. Like, I wouldn't wear these, like, to a nice night out. But this is perfect for work. And, like, these are great for, like, everyday daytime bags. So I'm just, like, super excited. And I wanted to have these colors because these are two bag colors I just don't have in any way, shape, or form. So, I don't know. I'm going to think about it. May keep both, may not. But, yeah, my new tail bars are here. All right, so it's time for me to get ready. So you guys may remember this dress from my fall haul, I think. I got it from J. Crew Factory, I believe. It's really cute, it has a nice slit. And then I'm gonna put this black blazer over it with my new knee-high boots. I don't, Lips and Looks hasn't come out before this, I don't think, um, but this, these two will actually be in there. Um, it's actually fairly warm. So I'm gonna go ahead and get ready. I'm gonna put a makeup, do my hair, and um, I'll be good to go. I think I forgot one of my undergarments, which is really annoying. I do have some stockings though, so maybe I'll do that. What are you doing? I am filming myself taking my hair down. But I think I should use my other camera. Auntie has more than one camera. There's the jinx. Did you know that auntie's birthday is after yours? Auntie's birthday. Yeah, she is born in April too. What the Kia? She's born in April too. Mm-hmm. It's daddy's birthday. Yeah, yesterday was daddy's birthday. And auntie forgot to bring his present from her apartment. So she's gotta bring it auntie back. Daddy's present. Yeah. Auntie Kia's got to bring it back. So you'll see her again. You'll see her again. Mm -hmm. And again, and again, and again, and again. Yeah, Errol told me that much. And uh, we, we just literally got off a call with him. 
And he's gonna he's coming out with a book now. Oh. And he has a publishing deal and with the machine behind it, a literary agent. So yeah. He's, he's gonna connect us with his people um, to start that process for him too. Oh yay! So, <gasps> Maybe they can tour together. Probably. <laughs> yay! That's awesome news. So I set all this stuff up. I'm the man behind the man. This is <laughs> not the man behind the I man. Set, I set him up with the attitude. And now I'm setting up with the with you the guy who knows the guy. So funny. <laughs> you about to be an agent? Yeah. I'm already an agent. I told him I need twenty five percent. Oh wow. I was oh. Like, I don't care what kind of part time oh, wow. job you get. I just need my cut. Oh wow. Twenty five. <laughs> <laughs> he was playing was funny. He said, like, man, you want twenty five percent? They want the eight percent. They want five. I was like, he said, well, what am I gonna get? I was like, well, you a handsome young guy, man. You just gotta make it do what it do. <laughs> <laughs> Not make it do what it do. <laughs> You are so funny. I mean, that's a you problem. <laughs> not a you problem. Jay said that is not a me problem, sir. <laughs> Work it out. Hey. Okay. What are you doing? I'm putting on makeup. I have boo boo. I have think about. Huh? I have think about. Think about. <laughs> Think about it. <laughs> Stink about it. 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 Uh, in the guest room. Ada! Ada! Oh. He was hitting by the box. What's I up? was. What's good? Yeah. yeah, nothing. We gotta do something together. We ain't done nothing in a while. You haven't. What have you been out here? You know, living life, working. Not your life. Capping. What's this? What this is? Oh, that's my new, that's my drill. Mm, okay. <laughs> That's my drill. Okay. All right. That's your little something, something. Something. Uh, just a little. A little drip drop. Just a little. Okay. <laughs> so you got chills. What you saying? I'm out here. Yeah. Stunting. In the streets. <laughs> Not in the streets. Not in the streets. <laughs> Never in the streets. Never in the streets. <laughs> but I'm out here. Uh, but yeah, we gotta do something. Yeah. Even if we, I don't know if there are any movies, but we can go to like Avalon or something. Yeah. Whatever, you gotta think of what you wanna do. Yeah. And we can do that. Yeah. Alright, man. What you here for? We're going to Alvin Ailey. Oh, mom's still going? Yes. Right, cool. She feels a little better. Right, so, so y'all taking Jason's, right? <laughs> Talk to your mama. <laughs> I got no <laughs> I got nothing. Hey. Get a better lighting in a moment but makeup and hair look good this is the dress you guys have seen this dress on a vlog or lips and looks i think no haul and then the boots try to get a better shot here i'll get my nephew to get me one and my gucci bag and my blazer so we're off Back and crack this window. 
your name? Lily. Hey, Lily. What can I get for you today? May I have a tall oat milk chai with one pump of brown sugar syrup? There's a tall oat milk chai with one pump of brown sugar. No water. No water. And may I have a warm cheese Danish? And a warm cheese Danish. Anything else? That's it. All right, got you. 907, we'll see you at the window. Thank you. Thank you. Keep your winning. I'm gonna make a better way. Hey, hey, better way. Oh, hey. Mom and dad's only daughter. Do I make you proud? Writing my life in lyrics to your life. All right, guys, I'm back from the matinee event and I'm a little like tired. I think it's mostly from talking to people because I'm an introvert. It's like a drain and I have another event tomorrow. So I bought a ticket to the movies and that is what I'm going to do tonight. It's 530. So I'm going to clean up this mess I made. Um, <laughs> not in the bathroom. Bathroom is fine. But like clothes and I was trying on clothes to figure out what I'm going to wear. Um, I'm oof, let me change this angle a little. Okay. And, um, oh, my hair looks good. <laughs> and um, I'm going to go ahead and make my meal plan for the next week as well as a grocery list. And then I'll head there. I'm hungry too. And I don't know what I'm going to do about that. So <laughs> for now, I'm just going to put away clothing. Y'all, I forgot to share. Okay, so what I bought from Ailey and my fandom is this top. Isn't it cute? I love the design this year. I'm gonna frame this. I have an idea, guys. You remember my opera shirt from New York? Premiere of that opera? You've got my brain in there. And then I loved the sweatshirt this year. Super cute. I got a medium, which may have been too big, but <laughs> I also think I'm fat, so there's that. Um, yeah, this is super cute. And I got the matching bottoms. And a medium as well. It says everybody dances for everybody. Oops, I dropped that. But you see, you see, like super cute together. <gasps> Ooh, or separate. I don't. This is gonna be the second hoodie I own, <laughs> and the second set I own of athleisure. So, yeah, super cute. Great for running errands come spring. Um, and also it'll give me enough to fangirl for a year because that shirt I'm gonna frame. So yeah, time is already a thing. I'm just gonna relax for a moment before I go to this movie. I'm gonna eat at the movie. I'm watching Death at the Nile, um, which is an Agatha Christie adaptation, book adaptation. And I'm super excited because I love Agatha Christie. I collect them. Um, she's like one of my favorite mystery writers. I mean, she is the cozy mystery writer. <laughs> That's my washing machine. I'm also washing clothes. But anyways, I'm just gonna chill, do those things, and I'll see you guys either later or tomorrow. Truth I own, I speak it, don't make sense now Give it a good, yeah, yeah. put that on good when it gets hard I stay on my job like no days off so you can go home With it, jump off my back Okay, breakfast. Avocado toast and a smoothie. And Trader Joe's has my favorite like berry smoothie mix. It has cherries. It's called berry cherry or something like that, but they didn't have it because supply chain. So I just got a few berry mixes. Matter of fact, I have a few Instagram reels sharing smoothie recipes, so I'll link my Instagram. But that's breakfast. I am having I'm doing smoothies and avocado toast. For lunch, I am doing lettuce wraps with yogurt. This is my favorite yogurt. Um, Liberty whole milk yogurt, especially the mango flavor. But that's expensive. <laughs> so I get that and Chobani. Um, the Liberty was three for four this week. So yeah, that's why I got three of them. And then um, you need lettuce for lettuce wrap too. And then for dinners, these are actually just like lazy dinners. So I love Trader Joe's frozen meal. So this is a beef bulgogi. And this is a kung pao chicken. And I tend to just eat them. I don't add rice. Um, 
but uh we'll see i haven't had the beef bulgogi one before and then i have some dinners planned um i have mushrooms because i want to do like a roast mushroom type situation with some veggies for dinner and then sausage peppers and onions which on my instagram there is a highlight with meals and I sh i've been sharing how to cook them lately because people have been asking so what i'm going to do is put all this away and then i'm going to go ahead and meal prep because all i have to do is cook chicken and i'll just i'll show you guys that y'all i can't be bothered <laughs> y'all i'm dragging so hard i'm going to get some tea um, i'm going to make my harney and sons earl gray add a little cream oh let me show you the creamer i've been enjoying lately uh, first let me turn on this water <laughs> I've been using the Calafia oat milk creamer. I don't like cow's milk, never have. Um, I'm, I'm in love with oat milk though. I love the consistency. And when I make Earl Grey, I like to add a, like a squeeze of lemon and a bit of cream over the top. Just Earl, Earl Grey has that bergamot flavor that can be really bitter and jarring. <laughs> um, but when you balance it, it tastes so delicious, so. I'm gonna throw that away and put those in the sink so I can wash them now that I have dishwashing liquid. And then I'll, we'll get started on meal prep. Just a cup. Marshalls has really good teacups, by the way. Squeeze of lemon juice. I didn't buy any lemons. <laughs> I might not have any lemon juice. If I don't, I have some lemon cream tiny I'll use instead, but I prefer lemon juice. Okay, I think I got just enough out. I need to buy some lemons. <laughs> Water, just a cup. I only want a cup of tea. I don't want a bunch. I think that's good. Um, warm the cream first so it doesn't separate just as a tip. Creamy. And then after I pour in <laughs> my tea, I will um, add some honey. Still have some Georgia honey. I get this from Trader Joe's, because Trader Joe's is the cheapest place to buy honey. I also have a thing of honey at work, and I still have some honey in my... Um, beehive here that I will use and then I gotta clean like decrystallize that but this is the honey I use if I'm out of lemon I got this from just at honey tea place I love excuse my nails I'm actually going to I'm actually going to take the polish off in a moment here and um okay get started on the chicken to get started on the chicken you just have to chop it up and season it let's take a moment for the hair color you can really see it in this light I've been trying to find the right light in this place for you to see the color. Look at this. Can you feel it? Can you feel it? Can you feel it? I, yeah. Okay, so now you guys can really see the brightness of the brown. And when I go in later in the month, we're going to add another bright tone. And it's just going to set it all the way off. <laughs> but now you can see. Okay, so I'm gonna cook the chicken, but before I do that, I'm just gonna give it a little salt and pepper because I'm gonna sauce the chicken in two different sauces. It just doesn't need a bunch. I'm just going to coat it, salt and pepper, toss it with my hands, and then I have my, this is one of my non-stick skillets um, going, and I just have this one because it's like huge, and I can cook all the chicken at once and not have this in stages, which is ideal. So. <laughs> And this is warming up and then once it's warm uh we'll cook the chicken it's really this is an easy meal prep that was water if you were new to cooking that's the way my mom used to have me test um to see if it was right <laughs> just put throw some water in a pan all right so you cook them to like five minutes and um Flip it in another five minutes, and it should be done. Ten minutes total. I'm also going to add some garlic. 
some flavor as well, some minced garlic. Butter. Soy sauce. I'll um, link a recipe video for the sauce because I don't, I don't have measurements, guys. I just do it by <laughs> what looks right. Teriyaki sauce. taste it. Okay. Pop of butter. Much more garlic. bit of sambal. Make another cornstarch and water slurry. First. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and toss this thing in it. Then go the rest of the way. All right, y'all, I got a reel done. I did my outro for Curl Smith versus Olaplex, which was an interesting experiment. Um, I did not get nearly as much done as I wanted to, but I got to go to this event and then I'll come back and see what I can do. Um, I think I did all my Instagram content for the week except one thing, which I kind of want to do either a hairstyle or something like that, but we'll see. And um, I did Curl Smith versus Olaplex. I'm filming this vlog right now. I really need to finish lips and looks. I just haven't had time because like I filmed the sit down but I've got to like show the outfits. Either way, I think I'm gonna do the twist out in my bathroom, start that in my bathroom. So I could do that when I get back either way. But um, I really want to film lips and looks. I wanna finish that. Uh, it just may not happen this weekend either way. <laughs> Oh, when I get back, I'm going to try to film something. But I did get the Patreon stuff filmed, so I will be able to put something up by the end of the night on Patreon, and I will put a video up, I think, on Tuesday as well. So doing good on Patreon, finally getting some podcast episodes up. I'm pretty sure I can get four up this month, so I'm super excited about that. Um, I put a shot list in here, and I also put my meal plans in here as well each week. So this is my catch-all um, bullet journal. This is what I put like weekly reviews, meal plans, notes for things. Like this is that thing that kind of is in between all the planner stuff. So I can keep all my notes in one spot. But anyways, now I've got to go. I'm going to ATL Ballet. Um, I'm gonna mix and mingle, try to, you know, get some, do some networking. And then they're doing Firebird and a few other dances. So this should be interesting. I don't think I've gotten any like filming for this video at any of the events this week so i'll try to get some at this event um let me put on some perfume before i go felicicos i ran out of my um hermes so i will be purchasing my um rose perfume which i finally figured out what it's gonna be um i am also proud of this outfit because i'm finally wearing these boots that i bought on year one of my capsule wardrobe journey um, so this, you guys have seen, this is a re sweater. I think I hauled it in a video. These are the black version of the pants I wore yesterday. Um, I love how wide they are. They flatter my shape very well. And then I wore these boots on a date <laughs> the other week when I was wearing all white. I wanted some brown boots and I just forgot I had them. So I'm just going to put these on and my new Telfizi, my red Telfizi is going with me to the ballet so because there will be traffic 
Let me get my butt out of here. I don't know how long it's gonna take me to get there. And I don't know um, how COVID is affecting their timing. So let me get out of here. Let me try to get a full shot of my outfit for you guys before we head out. Okay. So let's see. All right, I think that's the whole outfit minus my face, right? So you can see, I love this denim. It's very on trend, but still very cute for me. The boots keep me tall when I'm actually petite. <laughs> I be wearing boots all winter because it makes me taller. Every dude I meet is like, oh, you're tall. I'm like, no, I'm short, <laughs> but I like tall men. So being tall attracts tall men. It's great. <laughs> All right, guys, I made it. I barely made it. The sun is definitely growing, but I got the looks filmed for Lips and Looks, and I feel good about it. So now I just need to do a twist out just for the health of my hair, so my hair is ready for the week. But I also need to film it, so um, at least the parts of it, parts of it. So I'm going to go ahead and wash my hair and get this twist out going and um, watch some TV while I do it, I think. I think I've done all my filming and, and um, videography. I just need to take one photo of the lip colors, but other than that, I think I am good. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my hair. It's like so tragic to get rid of this beautiful twist out, but I'm gonna recreate it, so it should be good again. And then I'll probably throw in the towel for the night uh, because it'll probably be like eight or something, maybe later, <laughs> but we'll see. All right, the lineup, because I know some of you guys will care. I'm using the Trelux Curl Renew and Restore Cleanser. I'm actually gonna take my nail polish off and like fire my nails first. And then I'm just gonna condition and detangle with this Camille Rose Coconut Water Curl Coating Co-Wash. This is just a conditioner that I need to use up. And so I'm just gonna put this on my hair and detangle. This is how much is left. It should be enough. Um, if not, I'll pull out one of my other conditioners, but I mean, there should be enough. I'm not very heavy handed. Um, and once I rinse that out, I'm just going to style. This is a video that I think will come out after this one uh, with this trio. Uh, so we'll see if that works in that video. But I'm just going to try to make this as quick as possible to cleanse and condition. I'm not gonna pre-poo, nothing. <laughs> I'm just gonna go right in with water. Um, just take my time detangling because it's gonna take more time because I haven't done anything to prep my hair for it. Um, I'm just going to be really gentle with the tangling and get this done because I'm tired. <laughs> long weekends, guys. Long weekends. But I mean, hair. Hair is giving. Hair served all weekend. Love it. <laughs> 